Welcome back to my life. And uh, second one of the day. Usually don't do this, but you know what? I was sitting at home and I was counting the reasons why I should go outside again. One, it's not winter. Boom. Two, why not? Three, I can make a video. Four, it just rained and there's nobody around again. Like, amazing or what? This doesn't happen. I'm taking advantage of the fact that it doesn't happen. And uh, whatever. It's not even that windy. There's a little bit of wind. Probably get windier now that I said that. And the biggest reason of all, you might be able to hear in the background, I have to tap one of these damn gooses, man. Geese, goose. I didn't even say that. I gotta tap a goose. There's always people around, and I feel really awkward, like literally, like really chasing them and tapping them. I'll get over my fear. I, I record so much, I'm just starting to get used to the fact that I do this. So, it's gonna be good. But your video that I watched today, the two-parter, which is a, a next level type situation. How do you have that much stuff to say? <laughs> Nature, buddy. Um, that was an epic video. That was like you right in my face, you know, like uninhibited Brett. It's awesome. I can't even be that cool. I try. I need to, I put a toque on. Let's go. Let's go. Still not as cool. There's nobody around. I'm going to film some stuff. But first of all, I'm gonna see if these fish are doing anything. So I'm uh, in the mood. Cause I'm always in the mood. I was uh, looking at a bunch of rivers near here and what it turned out to be is that there is a lot of rivers here that have a lot of fish in them, but it seems like kind of a gamble to go to each and every one of them. So it's like, well, why am I driving so far away when I can walk out my door and there's like fishing right here? Kind of silly. I should just master this art. The art of friggin' hermitage and area. So that's what I'll do. Well, I've never actually taken you down to the water before, but there's nobody around. Look. I guess you've been down to the water before with me, maybe. But I've never like had like a full, fully functioning video like this one. Best video of all. Oh, I did, I did it last video. What am I talking about? Can you see that up there? the mud I don't see any action on the water so we're probably <clears throat> just gonna do videos which is okay too but uh, I brought a different rod with me today just in case there are fish because they're really small here so I was thinking that if I did get on fish for whatever reason or not I would use my three-weight rod now for most people they wouldn't care what a three-weight rod is and they'd be like why are you even talking about it? that's not very entertaining but for me I think it is entertaining to you so I will do it for you and your knowledge. Because you're like an up and comer, man. You're gonna be a fly fishing extraordinaire in time. I can see it, I can see it in our future. <clears throat> Three weight is just a smaller rod, basically. That's the easiest way to put it. This is very light, and um, basically, if you catch a fish with a three weight rod, it feels like a 10 pound fish. <laughs> I can't go that way. I could, it's just really wet. Maybe I'll try anyway, there's geese right there. Damn it. If there's no one in that one part, I'm tapping a goose today. Like, got it in my brain. I saw a wolf or a fox or a coyote or whatever you want to call it around here once. It's intense. Okay, I think this is a walking stick. You're supposed to walk on here, I think. Do you trust it? That's yeah, pretty good. Whew. How bad do you want me to fall off this right now? <laughs> oh yeah, that's good. Sorry for that interruption there. 
I can't believe there's no fish doing things. What a beautiful night. I gotta tell you, like, a couple days ago I thought I was legitimately dying. But I'm kind of a hypochondriac, so... Oh! What do we got there? Muskrat or something. Okay. I'm so in your domain. Everything's cool. I got some... Got some jube jubes for ya. Delicious jube jubes for ya. Mmm, delicious jube jubes. Ay! Oh. Gotta get more aggressive with these bastards. Something in the water right there. I don't know what it is. Oh, I'm under attack. Woo! Geese hate each other, eh? I'm in the thick of it here. I should have taken any other way. Oh, jeez. I'm getting soaked. <laughs> I should not have went this way. Oh. Ah. Yeah. Oh, freaking hell. Everything in life is hard. Oh, I got the camera wet. I gotta clean that off. I'm back. Okay, so is it easier to litter or hide your litter or just take it with you before you go? Oh, it's easier to hide your litter. Good job, world. Thanks. It's not getting better. Things aren't getting better. I'm not going the other way anymore. This is insane. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm so wet now. <laughs> All the things you think about. Oh, dang. There's always people where those geese are. Okay, so uh, what was I saying for? So our trip is pretty much complete. Um, we are done so I rented that other car this is the cool part it's a bigger car four door not two door it's not a smart car the other one's like a smart car it's so small it would not have worked at all and uh I changed it for a nicer car, a bigger car, one that'll be just as good on gas, brand new, put in all the things to get it, and it's actually uh, $50 cheaper. Eat that, that's pretty sweet. I didn't see it coming, I really thought it'd be more. I was prepared for that, that other car would not work. I really hope we see one on our trip, and then I'll be like, hey, that's the car that we were gonna get. And you'll be like, well, that wouldn't have worked. Yeah. This is much better. Okay, there's people there. I gotta go. This one's business. I want to do that mad charge. Charge! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> There's a muskrat there. Oh, Jay, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Jay, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Jay, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Alright, this game is done, son. <laughs> He just ain't having it. <laughs> I can't, can't believe I got her to charge at me. They're all so pissed right now. I'm interrupting their special group time. Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? 
Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? Who am I? All right, it's time to go. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, this scares me. Oh shit, there's one right there. Oh boy. There he goes. There's no way you can see him, but you could definitely hear him. Oh, damn! You gotta be able to see that, dude. They're trotting down the damn path. Sorry, man, like I should have totally like stopped and just like filmed it so it like would, like you could see them better. I hope it turned out, but that was, they were close to me, man. Holy, my heart was pumping. So I just heard him start to like wail. <sighs> okay, let's count her down. Two beavers, two muskrats, a freaking goose attack, and possibly almost a freaking <laughs> cougar attack or whatever those things are. Uh, freaking, I don't know what those are. Coyotes, can't even think straight. The one, the gray one just came like flying down the way. Like, I was looking at the one, and then out of the corner of my eye, I see one coming this way. I'm like, oh, that's it. That's it for me. Sayonara. Whew. I hope that, I hope that at least picked up so you could see how close they were. I know this thing kind of, the, the GoPro kind of distorts it a little bit. Like, it like seems, it kind of pushes things back because it's such a wide thing. And the thing's a, oh, okay. Too much adventure tonight. Thank you. Have a good day.